Curtis Stinson and the top-seeded Iowa Energy in Orem, Utah, to take on the seven-seeded Utah Flash in the first game of a three-game series in the NBA D-League playoffs. Good start for Tony Gaffney as he throws down the alley-oop to give the Flash a 10-9 lead. Gaffney, six points, four rebounds, but the Energy would take over from there. Up 10 now, the alley-oop to Marcus Blakely. He finishes a 14-4 run for the Energy at 15 points and 13 boards off the bench. Then Curtis Stinson in the lane. He lived there all night long here, putting the Energy up by six. More from him later, a huge night. Stanley Robinson getting in on the action to steal. Watch this play. Everyone thinks he dunks it, but no, it hangs on the rim for about a minute and a half. Gets his own rebound and jams it home. He had 12 points, six rebounds off the bench. And then to close out the first half, an exclamation point here by Michael Haynes. The Energy would lead by 12 of the half. Haynes had 14 points and three rebounds on the game. The third quarter, though, would belong to the Utah Flash. Andre Ingram, one of his five threes on the night. He had 22 points and four rebounds to lead the Utah Flash. And then the Flash down by two. No longer Orion Green buries the three. 15 points, seven assists, six rebounds, and four steals for Green. But the Energy would take over after that. Curtis Stinson again in the lane. He was 12 of 24 from the field, 5 of 5 from the free throw line. But Inkamo Jubu trying to keep his team close. He had a nice game off the bench. Uh, Brandon Costner went down with an ankle injury in the first half. He played huge in the second half, 17 points, 14 rebounds off the bench. But too much, too much Curtis Stinson down the stretch. Another floater in the lane, 29 points, 9 assists, and 7 rebounds for Curtis Stinson as he leads the Iowa Energy to a 103-96 win in game one of a three-game series. If you'd like tickets to an upcoming playoff game, go to nba.com slash dleague, and we'll see you at the game.